Hey boys, welcome back to some Kalen Ponga career mode. And as I spoiled in a, in a few episodes ago, I was talking about playing for New Zealand and also playing for the Maroons, which is, like I said back then, I think it's it's cool that um, they've sort of made it like this, I guess, that he's eligible for, for both. Obviously, it doesn't work like that. And um, it would have been nice if we were eligible for Australia, but yeah, it's still, it's still good that we are playing for... The Maroons. As we look at the Blues lineup, um, see how realistic it is. It looks a little, a little strange. <laughs> um, in the for some reason, I, I mean, I, I guess it's funny because um, you know Jared Croker. Like as we look at our team as well, uh, looks pretty strong. No Gregor Inglis, Milford, and Thurston are there. Uh, Smith is still there. Uh, pretty decent props, and you know, pretty similar back row. Uh, in the bench, pretty similar. Luke Keery, <laughs> Luke Keery is a Queenslander in this, which is funny because he does want to play for Queensland, but um, he's he's not he's not allowed. He's uh, he's a blue apparently, uh, which is which is funny. But yeah, he's he's a Queenslander on the on the game here, which is which is also funny. But yeah, it's uh, the Blues in the game here. They always Croker always gets picked, which is funny because. Um, in real life, Croker like never gets a, never even has a look in really. But like he's a he's a solid player. I don't probably I don't think he should be picked. But they don't even really talk about him, which is which is a little strange to me. Um, you know, he's just one of those solid players it's right here. Good kick goes up and he sort of went through everybody. Corey Oates on the wing uh, just scoops it up and diffuses it, which is nice. But yeah, looking at the teams, I'll be honest. I think our team is is stronger. I think our team is is pretty strong. The Blues lineup is is decent, is decent, but they've got um, who were the Haas? Maloney and um, oh, who was the other one? Chad Townsend. That's right, Townsend. <laughs> yeah, that's that's a little strange. But off the scrum here, I think we were coming up. Who were we up against there? Cordner? I think it was Cordner. We just beat him all ends up. The big right foot step just destroyed him, and uh, yeah, the scrums, the one on one, it's uh, it's a perfect place to to get some tries. Honestly, you get that one on one miss, the speed of Ponga to get to the outside, and and away he goes. As uh, Cameron Smith is converting, and another little weird thing about the game is that Smith is supposedly a better kicker than Thurston on the game. I don't, I don't know why, but. You know, Smith, is, he's a good kicker, but as Croker was talking about him, he's going to burn us on the inside there. That's I've talked about it a few times, that when the AI gets into the clear, defending as the fullback here, it's so hard because you look at him, he's, just, he's, he's, got, the, he's got the head shape to the right, and then he just swivels and, and cuts off his right foot. Yeah, it's it's tough. It's tough to defend. You've sort of just got to... I, I, I think the key is to, to get up quickly but not not rush them sort of get up off the line and then sort of try to try to just try to anticipate but also just sort of hold off that's why you need a bit of room to move if you're right on your goal line you you don't have the time but if you if you get up and then you can sort of shadow them especially if you're a quick fullback you can just sort of shadow them if they get a pass you so that's uh that's a big thing there is uh we go for a 40 20 here it's a good kick as uh tedesco gets back and he's gonna run out of the field on fire shocking effort there james tedesco that's uh it's a bit of a blue from the blue himself so we're gonna get a nice scrum feed right here and uh like i said it's a it's a good place to attack could just go for the try line honestly but we skip to the outside pass it to milford milford cuts back takes on a croaker and he's going to power his way over the line so again the scrums work a treat it was a nice ball and milford just um off the left foot he just put the afterburners on and uh croaker he did, he did a good job to get across there and make the contact but yeah milford just too strong in the hips there and drives his way past him and scores a uh, a very crucial try so it's been it's been a good game it's been a it's been a solid start by us and you know, the Blues, are they're playing well as well. So, it's a, it's a good quality first origin match here. It's not a bludger like sometimes the first matches are. Is we, uh, we find ourselves on the wing here, put in a little chip and chase as well. That was that was fantastic play. Just saw the opportunity on the blind side there for an overlap and and uh, and went well. Honestly, that was that was very nice. Very nice play. As, uh, it's going to be the last play here. 12-4 up, so we don't really need to go for a field goal. I was, I was thinking about it, but... 
Yeah, got the eight-point lead, which is nice, as uh, Milford's going to put up the kick for us. It's a good kick as well. We just can't get above Tedesco, and he streaks away too. We miss the ankle tap. Thurston, Milford giving chase here. Thankfully, Milford is going to round him up. That is a huge tackle. That would have been a massive momentum changer in this match if Tedesco streaked away and scored right there. Boy, oh boy, that would have been that would have been a, a tough uh, tough pill to swallow because it was a good kick. We got to it in time, but just to, uh, couldn't quite time the leap to perfection. As the kick goes up, Coriosi stands his ground, safe as houses, like he always is. As uh, the Blues get a chance very late in this first half to sneak a try. Should be one last play. They go to the right. Townsend takes the line on. Poor play from uh, from the half back there. And it's going to go half time, 12 4 to us. Uh, yeah, we've had the possession, but also we've had a few a few errors as for Fida. He's just going to burst a few of his couple of tacklers. And he's one player I'm very happy he's, uh, he's pledged, his allegiance, uh, <laughs> pledged his allegiance to Tonga as uh, good defense on our try line there. Graham gets rolled over. But uh, yeah, for Fida, he's been the best forward or the best front rower in the game or in the NRL this year without doubt. So it's very nice that he's not playing for the Blues this year. I've got to be honest, that is uh, that is a massive plus. But uh, right here, I don't know what the dummy half was doing there. Just passed it into Fafida on the last play. As, uh, again, we just, the Blues, they, they've come out firing in the second half. We're, uh, we're sort of on the back foot from the get-go. Uh, but last tackle, he just takes it to the line, Maloney, and it's just a, it's a nothing play. Just too far into the line takes the contact, drops the ball, so that's that's poor stuff, but then on the back of that, we're going to make another error of sort of, I was looking to run off Anthony Milford, and then big Dylan Napa was just sort of standing in the way, and he knocked it down, so that's uh, that's poor stuff, as Tedesco goes for line, Milford, a huge tackle, that was a try saver right there, I was trying to come across, but yeah, that was massive, as Fafida also driving myself and uh, Maguire, Again, a try saver. With online defense has just been incredible this game. And again, Paul Gallen this time is going to get held up. The good kick into the end goal. But what defense? This is unlike Beer Pro. Usually it's so hard to defend our try line. But this, it's funny because it feels like an origin game. Like we're just on our on our try line defending our backsides off. Is right here. We That was, honestly, that was probably our worst play of the game right there. We just, it was a good run. And then, you know, the pass, I don't know if it was even forward, but we just shouldn't have thrown it. We were defending our line. We just had to take the tackle and, and move on, just get the kick in. But thankfully, we do defend it again. There's uh, a bit over 10 minutes to go, so we're not out of the woods yet. But, uh, you know, we've thought it most of the Blues attacking. You know, you got to be at, at this stage, you got to think that they're a little frustrated, a little bit, um, yeah, a little bit frustrated with their attacking. Our defense has been spot on as a kick into the corner there by Thurston. We chase, but uh, miss a tackle. Thankfully, it was good defense there on the wing um, from Kyle Feltz, in fact. As, uh, again, good little inside play. This time, we just take the tackle nicely and just wear the clock down. It looks like we got the game basically wrapped up. Don't want to talk too soon. <laughs> There's the big shot as well. Uh, so the ball does, does get coughed over, but yeah, the time is ticking away here. We just got to defend pretty well this set. Even if they score on the last play, I think it's probably game over. So it's been a, it's been a good, a good debut. We've uh, we played well. We got involved. A couple of silly mistakes from us, but overall, I think we've been uh, exceptional. The rest of the team as well, like the Milford has been great. Uh, probably the other standout, honestly. And then the forwards have stood up and a couple of try savers. Maguire was excellent as well. So yeah, we do pick up man of the match. As you see, too many errors. That's something we need to fix. But hopefully you guys are enjoying the series. Make sure to like it. I'll see you in the next one.